Good morning everyone, today is Monday and we are back at it again for another week of mowing and a little bit of landscaping. So uh, today we just got mowing, we got about I think 25 yards we have to do today. No, what is it, 20, it's like 23 yards we have to do today. But I'm going to be rolling solo today um, and um, Jeff and Rico, I'm actually going to pick Rico up now. Jeff, he's at the shop getting everything prepared. It is 7.03, I'm actually late. Um, I told everybody though we were gonna be a little bit late today. So, here we go. All right, so we're at the shop. I just got here. Gonna go in the building and see what the guys are up to. See if they got everything ready oh, it's here. yeah it is what's up Joe? what yeah. mm. can't operate that like that oh is this the one that the blades are messed no. up no that's the other one how'd that happen I don't know. I went to pull it and I looked at it and I'm like, that's not right. Was it just a bolt then? Yeah, some, somewhere. I can't figure out where the bolt goes in there. I see two bolts missing on the bottom, but I don't know if they're actually bolt holes. The only spot I can see the two bolts. I don't know if those are dumb, but I don't think so. No, move, the, move this motor again. Let me see. Shake the motor. Hold on, hold on. Do it again. Don't see it's no. got to be up under here you because you can hear it let me see let me get my phone oh i know where it's at Joe. you do yeah all right it's all in here huh it's up it's under this plastic here. it's all up in here mm-hmm but how do you access it it's all in the back side but it's got to be just two bolts huh something simple Oh, damn. It's up underneath where yeah, the belt is. Exactly. Right. So they're going to take that cover off. All right, well, let's fix this then before we get to work. Okay. Because we have to fix that. You guys got some yards to push mow. I, I, I was going to attempt to take it apart. Yeah, go ahead and take it apart because we got to. Which one or that one? Huh? Which one of them? Which one? That one or this, this one? This one's broke too. But I don't know why this one's broke. What? No, it's because of the. the the belt, the yeah. belt the, the pool. Got you. The motor's loose or something. I don't know. Look. I think some bolts came loose up under it. Just need to tighten down for real. Did it try to start though or no? Oh, they didn't start. Oh, it's just you can't, don't run it like that. Yeah. You don't run it like that. No, don't. Some, something happens. Yeah, no. Throw it all off. Real, yep. Mm hmm. Real big time. Don't put, you don't play around with motors. Yeah. Yeah, go ahead and take that black cover off and then uh just see if you can reach it from in here it's got to be just two bolts in there yeah. just just need some a nut to, to anchor it down <sighs> did you get the other um the battery plugged in on this truck yet yeah, all right i'm about to start her up okay I want to get you a whole nother spool yeah. to where we can just split it evenly so we're not winding string every day. Keep going, you're good. Go, 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 go. Keep going. Keep going. Good. Cut it all the way. You say you seen what? I said I came in here and I went to, to full start the motor. Yeah. Make sure it started. And you seen that? I saw that. So wow. Right. Yeah. You're good on my side. Just take out the door on your side. <laughs> and then blame it on Jeff. Hit the mirror. And then blame it on Jeff. <laughs> blame it on me. Uh huh. <laughs> then plug in the ramp rack light, see? It's always something. Always gotta double check your equipment. Tighten those down, those are good. Alrighty. I got to both weed eaters. Uh, 
What's that? Lost the lock, huh? Look at that. Lost the lock. Dag. Hey, Jeff. Uh, on the other truck, uh, the, you got to attach the lights for the dump yeah, trailer. I okay. I already saw Yeah, plug that back in and then we'll be good to go. Okay. All right, we just got to the gas station. We're about to fuel up and get this show on the road here. <sighs> hey, Jeff, truck's acting funny again. It's just, uh,. My RPMs are just going up and down a little bit, and it, when I hit the gas, it's sputtering. Just got to change out the mother coil packs, probably. What? No, I got something in mine. Go ahead and pour this into yours. Or pour it into mine, and, and I'll give you guys the full one, because I don't need a full one. No, don't, hey, that, don't. That, that, that's, that's, that's <laughs> don't be spinning He's the truck out now. Uh-huh. Right. What you got? About a half tank, a little more? All right. All right, I'll see y'all boys in a minute. Uh, just call me uh, if there's any problems, anything you guys see, anything you don't like. Do I get... Yeah, but I don't have a backpack blower. Where? Right there. That's yours? Or what you got, no, two? I got one inside. Yeah, I need that one. Get me that blower. How the hell are you going to take both the, the big ones? <laughs> I'm going to try to take both the big blowers. I, they, I left it in the truck. Yeah, all right. I didn't take it. All right. No, I'm just kidding. All right, well, have a good day. I'll see you guys in a little bit. All right, Jeff. I'll see you guys. Drive safe. All right. All right, so that's it for the gas station. I am heading out to go start my list. I have, I think I have 10 yards I have to do by myself today, which isn't no, no problem. I'm gonna knock them out and then I have I think three estimates I gotta give and we're gonna go from there. Looking good, looking good. <laughs> Alright, well, I will see you guys at the first yard.
finished yard. One down. Nine more to go. Nine o'clock. Not too bad. Nine, what, nine twelve? Took him about 25 minutes by myself. All right, off to the next one. All right, guys, so I am, uh, I'm on my way to my second yard right now. Um, I did just want to share with you guys that when you're doing mowing, uh, route density is so important. Like right now, I left that other house at 12, 13 and um it's literally i'm driving three minutes to my next property so right now 13 14 15 16 9 16 i'll be at the next house so just a little bit of advice if you're if you're really just trying to just cut grass and just do mowing um the biggest thing is just route density if you're just starting with one yard target as many yards in that neighborhood as possible before you try to go to different sides of town and anything like that conquer that one neighborhood as much as possible like right now I just did one property three minutes from here and now I got this one here and I got this one here all right so it started raining on me a little bit so I had to, I hopped in the truck you know one thing I we do we will work in the rain but as long as it's a very light sprinkle but we always, I, well, me personally, I always tell all my guys to, if it starts raining hard, just get off the equipment, go sit in the truck for a minute. Don't try to finish the yard up while it's pouring rain on you. Just go sit in the truck, let the rain stop, you know, and if it doesn't stop, of course, we're done for today. But if you see that the rain, it stops in about 10, 15 minutes, just, just wait in the truck until it stops. I just got finished up with the yard. Uh, it is 9.56, so I started this yard, it was like 9.19 or 9.20, so let's say 20, 30, 40, 35, 35, 40 minutes it took me to do two yards. Alright, so that's number four down, uh, this, is, this is the finished product right here, corner lot, uh, this one took me a little bit longer just because it is a little bit bigger, had a lot more weed eating to do. Who is this right here? I'm about to pull up on somebody. Let's see, it's my boy Jamar. It's my family right here. Let's see. They've got them out there working it. That's awesome. Look, the boss in the truck doing paperwork. <laughs> hey, get out the way! Oh, What's, up, What's man? going on, man? Good, good. I just seen you over there. I was like, oh, I gotta pull up oh, on him. Yeah, hell yeah, getting yeah. busy, man. Yeah, it's super busy, bro, for hell real. Yeah. A couple clean outs, couple cuts. Yeah, what's man? up, man? Stay on the schedule for That's real. That's right. Hey, it's hard, man. All this rain we've been getting. Hey, man, you doing your thing. I'll be watching your video. Yeah, no, word, man. Like you about to be on it right now. Man, you doing your thing. Yeah, what's bro. your company called, man? Shut your, shut your. Care, Pro's Lawn Care. Pro's Lawn Care. Hit him up, man. In the Akron area, man. It's, it's money out here for everybody, everybody man. man. For That's sure. Great, appreciate you. Man. Word, Keep man. Hey, you too, bro. Yeah, I'll see you in a minute. Up, yep. All right, guys. So I am at yard number eight right now. Uh. I thought I had my camera on, but I didn't. But I done weed eat it already. Did all the weed whacking. Now I just gotta mow. One, two, three, four, five, six, about six different lots in this area. So I'm gonna go ahead and get a little bit of footage mowing. And then uh we'll be on to the next yard. <clears throat> Yeah, that last yard really threw, threw me off a little bit. It took a little bit longer than I wanted to. I hate getting on a yard and it hasn't been cut or touched. It really bugs me. But now it's done. And, uh, you know, just move on to the next one. Now I got it for the rest of the season. No more complaining. Everything should be good to go. Before I go into the front of this property, or too far away from my mower, I'm going to fill this thing up with some fuel. 
be because who wants to be all the way away from your lawnmower and then the thing runs out of gas not I I done done that too many times Ugh. all right so filling this up now I'm gonna uh, get me some fuel in here and then I'm gonna head to the front That one took a little while, about an hour. Uh, it's a good yard though. Um, basically this 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 one that I do that took an hour, uh, I charge like three times as much as I would for a regular lot. So at the end of the day, I made a good amount off of this yard in just one hour. So I'm really, really happy so far. We're moving along. Well, I'm moving along. I got uh here's the finish on this side over here. I don't know if you can really see it. A couple little crooked stripes in there, you know what I'm saying? Some easy money, easy mowing. <laughs> Alright, well, I am on my way to another yard. I got the funeral home up here I gotta do. And then I got a couple more. Literally the funeral home is 30 seconds from this property. So I'm actually headed there now. And then I'm gonna uh knock it out get this easy money all right i'll see you up there all right so i just got to the other property literally 30 30 seconds down the road i mean i love having close properties Rico, Yo. what's up? How you guys doing? Good. How many you guys got done? Uh, All right, sounds good, bro. I'll see you guys back at the shop. Uh, All right, bye. Awesome. So we're gonna get everything done today. I got two properties that I'm going to now. Uh, they're both right next door to each other. The one. I gotta mow both of them and then the one, I, so I'm gonna go ahead and record that and then I'll see you guys there. All right guys, so we are at this property here. We're about to cut this one. And then I have one, the white house down there. Uh, that needs a cut and uh, so I did forget though, I was supposed to trim her bushes here and pull out some of the dead uh, stuff in her yard. So I'm gonna have to give her a call and let her know that We'll be back out tomorrow to do that. Well, I'm going to come out here tomorrow and do it. So I'm not going to record on this property. I'm just going to go ahead and mow it. But I will show you guys the after. All right, guys. So this one is done. Just finished that one up. I'm about to go down the street to the next one now and do a nice cut. Weed whack. And another tip for you lawn care guys uh don't never fill your mowers any of your equipment up in the grass always do it on the concrete because you never know your lid might not be on you might overflow the mower you know you might have some air in there and it busts out everywhere but you just don't want to do it on the grass because if you get gr gas on the grass you will kill the grass and who just wants a big yellow spot 
on their tree lawn or right in the middle of their yard so take your time get the mower off of their yard and get your fuel in it on the concrete or do it on your trailer but yeah that's just something i wanted to tell you guys before i started mowing this yard But, uh, whew, long day today. Did, uh, I think I did 12 yards by myself. And I'm going to run an estimate now. But this is the end of the video for today. Once again, I really appreciate you guys watching. Uh, don't forget to give me a thumbs up on these videos if you like them. And uh, like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. I really appreciate it. See you guys tomorrow.